In 2022, Ukraine attracted the world's attention and became a symbol of resistance and defiance in the face of a powerful enemy. Powering Ukraine's struggle is our long, rich and vibrant culture. Ukraine has been a diverse and multi-ethnic land, a home to communities from Jews and Greeks to Crimean Tatars and Swedes. This history has helped generate cultural masterpieces, an Armenian-born film director producing a world-known film depicting Hutzels of Western Ukraine, or a Ukrainian composer creating a popular Christmas carol song across the globe. Let's look at some of Ukraine's cultural landmarks and how you can explore them on Wikipedia. Cinema. Ukrainian film art dates back to the late 19th century, and it's especially active today. Wikidata contains information about over 700 films that originated in independent Ukraine. One of the early classic movies is Earth, a 1930 silent film by Alexander Dovzhenko. It was banned by the Soviet government nine days after release, but widely considered to be one of the greatest movies ever made. According to one film expert, Earth is a poetic movie that depicts Ukrainian spirit, but also the universal truths of human life. Another great Ukrainian movie is Shadows of Forgotten Ancestors, created by the Armenian filmmaker Sergei Parizhanov. It's a vivid and colourful story of tragic love set against the folk traditions of the Hutzels, an ethnic subgroup of Ukrainians in mountainous western Ukraine. In recent years, Ukrainian directors have produced a lot of important award-winning movies. For example, you might watch crime drama film The Tribe, a silent movie shot in Ukrainian sign language, or pull up Netflix to see Rhino, a film about the tumultuous decade of the 1990s in Ukraine. Music. Did you know that one of the most popular Christmas songs was created in Ukraine? Shedrik, or Carol of the Bells, was composed by Ukrainian composer Mykola Leontovich. As Ukraine is home to many cultures, Ukrainian music is diverse. 1944, a song performed by singer Jamala that won the Eurovision in 2016, tells the tragedy of deportation of the Crimean Tatars by the Soviet government. Also, check out contemporary bands that use authentic Ukrainian instruments to achieve modern sounds, such as Daka Braka or Anuka. Architecture. Ukraine is home to many architectural masterpieces, from the beautiful churches in Kyiv to Baroque palaces in Western Ukraine, to Belgian legacy in the industrial regions of Donbass. Since 2012, Wiki Loves Monuments Photo Contest gathers pictures of Ukrainian cultural monuments. Over 10 years, we've collected 350,000 photos on Wikimedia Commons and Wikipedia. Visual art. Ukrainian visual art has many forms and manifestations, from the Prophet Elijah by Ukrainian monumentalist Mikhailo Boychuk, who was part of the generation of the executed Renaissance, to Maria Primachenko's fantastic world of plants and animals. Today, one of the most interesting examples of visual art are murals in Kiev and elsewhere. Popular culture during the war. Internet memes are also an important part of culture, especially when they power real-life resistance. As Russia started an all-out invasion of Ukraine in February 2022, the Ukrainians have united to resist, militarily, but also with art and memes. Many of these memes are already covered on Wikipedia, you can read why an anti-tank weapon became a literal icon, or how a decorative Mayalika rooster helped millions of Ukrainians live through the hardships of war. Ukrainian culture is distinct, diverse, and worth falling in love with. With around 60 million articles in 300 languages and tens of thousands on Ukrainian culture, Wikipedia is a good place to start exploring Ukraine and contributing to its coverage.